Um, it's a pleasure to be here um, and to follow up from what was just said. Uh, you know, when I have to admit that when every member of the advisory council was sort of approached for this, I mean, your first initial reaction is a cynical one. One more award show, one more award function. Does the country really need that? But when we were taken through the objective of TOIFA and what TOIFA intends to do, uh, I think that cynicism had come from the feeling that award functions have felt very sort of commercialized, not that credible, uh, not really rewarding the best in entertainment the way that it should be with a transparent and a clear system. When the members of the advisory council were taken through the process of what TOIFA intends to do, uh, from the fact that they've tied up with the guild uh, to create an academy. Uh, that really is the way that Hollywood did more than 100 years ago. I'm so glad that we're doing it now and we're going down that road to have the most number of jury members possible to bring ENY in and create such a transparent and such a candid system in terms of the selection process. When we were taken through that, I think we were all sold. And when you look at the list of the names of the people who are on the advisory council, right now there's uh, there's, uh, there's me and Madhurita here, but there, there's a whole uh, list that you went through. I'm speaking on behalf of all of us. We were really, really impressed and we wanted to be a part of it because we feel this is something that the industry sorely needed. We need a credible, we need a transparent system of rewarding the best in media and entertainment in a way that removes the cynicism that has been associated with the award shows in, in the recent past. Uh, in fact, in the very first uh, meeting that the Advisory Council had along with ENY and uh, uh, the folks from the Times Group, uh, they presented the list of categories to us. And we had suggestions about there being the requirement for technical awards to be incorporated as well. And I have to say, we were also impressed with the speed uh, with which they took up the suggestion, came back to us, told us that that made sense, it would be implemented. They had planned to implement it maybe a couple of years down the line. They decided to implement it from year one. That shows you that the intent is absolutely correct. Uh, the intention is to be able to make sure that unlike other award shows where the nominees don't land up because people tend to know in advance who's winning the awards, this will be one of those shows in which over a period of time, I'm not saying it might happen in year one, but over a period of time, as the talent realizes that this is a credible and transparent system, all the nominees will land up because they will have the respect for the award, land up, and the award, the, the person winning the award will be announced right there with no one else knowing that name in advance. I think that's the intention. The intention really is to make TOIFA something that becomes a gold standard, and we're all very, very proud to be a part of it. So, great job, thank you. So glad that we're involved and thank you.